Oh, is that you telling me you're ready? Hey everyone, today we went to the Tulare Sci-Fi Convention and there were a mix of things from uh, shopping for collector's items, sci-fi, comic book, um, and some horror sprinkled in there. And I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that I picked up and if you watch this video through, there'll be um, some video of the actual experience, so more of like a little vlog thing. Okay. This little guy, so cute. He's on a sort of um, pendant so I could wear him as a necklace. I just had to pick up a really cool chain. Um, the guy had, the guy who created this guy had a really cool um, table. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and link his, I believe Etsy shop in the description. Really cool stuff, very creative, very artistic, amazing job with all of his work. And this is just an example of one of them. I just love this little guy's face. I'm probably gonna name him. So if you guys have suggestions for a name, go ahead and leave them down in the comments down below. He's just amazing. Um, if there was a full-size guy of this, I definitely probably would have picked it up too. Just like a creepy little figure guy. I love these kinds of things. Uh, okay, so I finally got my Homicidal Homemaker pin, which I absolutely love. It is gorgeous. Um, I don't know if you guys can see the glitter, but that bird is obnoxiously loud. Um, but it is an amazing pin and I love it. And um, I'll go ahead and link the Homicidal Homemakers um, Etsy in the description below so you can pick one of these amazing pins up. Um, it's a really good deal. Okay, so if you haven't checked out the Homicidal Homemakers channel, you really need to because she's got some amazing uh, food items that you can use for parties or just like everyday life because, you know, horror fans love to have these kinds of things in everyday life. But um, yeah, you should check it out. Not only does she share these amazing recipes with you um, on her channel, but all of her videos have really cool movie themes or horror related themes and it's just a lot of head nods to original movies and they're just awesome so check her out I'm gonna go ahead and link her uh, YouTube channel in the description as well as her Etsy um, store so okay I also have this awesome um, Night of the Sea Monkey a disturbing tale um, and this is a movie by Michael Rodriguez it's one of my favorite independent local horror movies. It has a really good sense of humor to it. And if you haven't checked it out, you really need to. It's just, it's got this really cool 80s feel, throwback horror movie feel. And it's all about this awesome uh, sea monkey. And I got to see the sea monkey today. I'm gonna go ahead and put a, the picture in um, this video. But if you haven't seen it, you should check out his stuff. Um, really interesting movie. I'm glad I got to see it when I did. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and link his Facebook in the description and you guys should definitely order yourself a copy if you really want a hidden gem because this movie is amazing. I love it. And if you have seen it, go ahead and let me know what you thought of it down below in the comments. <music> These two people over there, they'll give you your guys' okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Zombie Girl, award-winning short film now on YouTube and VHX. And then we have our film coming out, Machine Gun Baby. It's about a baby who escapes his own abortion and comes back to kill his mom. And then we've got our other comedy coming out on 420 called Border Brothers the Movie. And it's about a guy who smuggles weed over the border and accidentally smuggles two Mexican guys. Beautiful I love stuff. it. I love it. So yeah, and free posters. This is our poster for Naked Zombie Girl. And we also got A Familiar Spirit, which is going to be online soon. It's currently going through the film festival circuit.
Wait. Someone's reading me. <laughs> Do you remember them? Hi, baby. You hey. mentioned in October. She's a little bigger than the last time. Yeah, she's, okay, you remember Fetch Armstrong from the doll? Yeah. It's like, that's like what her body's like. It's like someone just yeah. keeps stretching her. She's super long. <laughs> she really is. So cute. Oh, I love her coat. That, that brown, it's beautiful. We always say that she's chocolate peanut butter with the little cookies and cream right there. Yeah. Brit or Classics Frankenstein. I'm filming. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. Sunday afternoon. Um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and don't forget to check all the other people out that I discovered today. And I'll see you guys later.